Okay guys, so today is just one of those days I'm going to have to be flexible. My boys are home from school today due to high COVID cases. So what does that mean for me? I won't be able to attend mass today. I will have to watch it online at nine. Then later this afternoon, I will go for a run and say the rosary, maybe twice. Please pray for me. I am going to need all your prayers and lots of coffee. Okay, I'm gonna walk down the hall. I'm gonna show you the boys in their rooms, working hard. There's Logan, say hi. And there's Henry. Henry, are you making sure the boys are working hard? And then in here oh, is Billy. Found found you found one? Good job. Billy, you working hard? Hey guys, so I just finished my run and saying the rosary and I felt way better until I checked my email and saw a message from the school saying that we were going to take the rest of the week off and be home with our children. So please keep up those prayers. Hey everyone, I hope all of you out there are having a successful day 44. What a day I've had today. As most of you know, when your children are home, it's harder to get anything done. So today, I just had to give up control and truly be flexible. Overall, we had a great day. Yes, I did yell a bit, but I do have two crazy boys and sometimes that's the only language they respond to. As you all know, my plan was to watch Mass at 9 and wouldn't you know that at exactly 9.05, just in time for the first reading, Billy needed help with his schoolwork. So I brought my phone with me and set it up on his desk so I could listen to it while I helped him. Maybe it was because the three of us were using the Wi-Fi or Jesus was really trying to teach me some patience today, but for some reason, the Wi-Fi kept cutting out. Instead of getting mad, I shut off my phone, helped Billy, and decided to read the daily readings instead of watching Mass. Throughout the day, I took many attempts to try to read them, but every time I thought I had a minute, Billy needed me. Finally, school was over. The boys went outside and I was able to sit and read. As I sat there, unshowered, sweaty from my run, hair a mess, and feeling drained, I heard exactly what I needed to hear. I am a temple of God. Isn't that just such an amazing thing to think about? Can you even believe that God loves us so much that he lives in us? The Spirit of God dwells in us all and we are all holy. I may be a hot mess on the outside, but on the inside I am beautiful because of him. I hope all of you out there are having a blessed day 44. Please know that I am praying for you always and I will see you tomorrow.